Oh, hi there. Guess what? Oil prices are the lowest they've been since 2010. But I don't care, and neither does the rest of America. Even though oil's so cheap, oil consumption is lower than it's been in 40 years. So there's no better time to celebrate Hanukkah, the festival of oil conservation. The story of Hanukkah is that Judah and the Maccabees took back the temple, and they had to keep the menorah lit for eight days with just one day's worth of oil. But it lasted the whole eight days. And technically we celebrate Hanukkah because that's a miracle of God. But I prefer to think of it as a great story of energy efficiency. So traditionally, Jews like to celebrate this miracle by frying carbs in oil because that is delicious. I am going to celebrate this new era of energy efficiency the same way. So today we're going to make some latkes. My mother, wonderful Jewish woman that she is, is kind of the Lil Wayne of latke making. And if we're going with that metaphor, I consider myself to be the Drake of latke making. Kind of uh, building on the platforms that Lil Wayne has created for him in the hip hop world. And so today I'm going to do the original, the classic, but also little experimental latkes with some beet and some apple. So latkes are very simple. You shred potatoes, you shred onions, and then if you're my mom, you shred them a little more after that. Now mine are pretty good, but my mom's been making them like many, many more times. You mix them together with flour and egg and salt and pepper, and then, as I said, you fry them in just a ton of oil. The beet latkes were excellent, I thought. They were delicious and had great texture. The apple latkes were a little soft and uh, honestly not sweet enough. But you know, I believe that sometimes it's important to break with tradition and experiment. And I think the same lesson can be applied to our energy sourcing today.